What's up guys, B here. Hope everyone is doing well and they're staying safe and healthy together with their family. I want to start off by thanking each and every one of you that is watching this video. Thank you so much for your support, for liking, sharing, subscribing, and even throwing a comment here and there on my videos. It means a lot, a lot to me. And please do continue to do that. And if you're not subscribed, please do consider doing a subscribe. It doesn't cost you anything. And it helps me with growing the channel and as well growing into the future and having new projects on the line, such as Funko News uh, and many, many other unboxing reviews and stuff like that. Without further ado, let's get into the video for today. So today I'm gonna show you an unboxing of some goodies that I bought from Marketplace. Found these Funkos at the cellar. I was interested in only three of them, I'm gonna be honest. But the other two were tempting because they were thrown into the deal. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna get these two as well, why not? A deal is a deal, so... Yeah, so let's open and see what we got. Let's start off with one of the special ones. It being She-Hulk from the 2018 Spring Convention exclusive. Uh, it depicts uh, She-Hulk and the lawyer, because she in essence is a lawyer and before becoming She-Hulk. Uh, Jennifer, I think her name is um she's a lawyer as a profession and even after becoming she hulk she uh, continued doing the um, the job that she had basically the condition that i got it is okay she has here a little bit of rip a little bit not too much and here a little bit dented as well as you can see but other than that it's in pretty good shape for a 2018 uh, uh, Funko Pop. It's, it comes in the collection with uh, Spider-Gwen, She-Hulk, the classic look, Marvel, Captain Marvel, Doctor Strange, Doctor Octopus, and Falcon. Uh, this I was interested mostly because it's one of the classic looks from the TV series that they had, TV series, the cartoon series, and also the comic book series that this is basically how she looks like so i really wanted this one when i saw it i had to get it because yeah i'm a marvel fan i'm a dc fan i'm an anime fan but getting these type of things is what makes me happy basically so into my collection Second one is from the Funkos I wasn't really that interested but I still got them is Luke Skywalker the oldie uh, look where he has like some sort of cane or I don't know but yeah it's Luke Skywalker I think he has a problem with his head because it's a little bit tilted as you can see I don't know if it's damaged or not I did not check it Probably I'm going to check it after uh, filming this video. It's in mint condition, I'm going to be honest, besides that head thingy. It doesn't have any rip, any crease, anything in all this fair. This is from uh, the line with um, the crap series that they did with Star Wars, the last three episodes. Uh, uh, yeah. A lot of people don't like it, me included, but having Luke Skywalker elderly in the collection is something that I was after, to be honest. <laughs> Like this, don't do wrong. 
Android phone call. Again, something that I was not interested, but I still got it because, yeah. It's the Supreme Leader Snook. This one is actually very nice because his garb or uh, robe or whatever, it seems metallic. It, it was painted. It's It looks painted, but it's a metallic paint. Looks very, very cool on him. Um, it, as you can see here, I don't know if you can see that wall I'm trying to show. It has a little bit of crease here, like a dent in the box. Which is kind of sad, but it's in mint condition otherwise. Uh, I'm going to put in the protector when I get my protectors. Uh, Supreme Leader Snoke is one of the baddies. The dark side of the force uh, that's against Jedi's always instigating and stuff like that. Uh, it comes in the collection with the Luke Skywalker, the oldie guy, uh, Praetorian Guard, First Order... B898, BB8, Rose, and Chewbacca with the Porg, which I actually got, which I actually was very hyped. So now I'm getting the whole collection. Jesus, now I'm noticing slowly but steady, I'm getting the whole collection on this. This is my third Funko from the collection. I, I think I have, no, actually the fourth because I have BB9E uh, as well. I have this one and the Metallic uh, Special Edition. So I have four in this collection. Jesus. And I did not notice even. Cool. That's really cool. Two more Funkos to go. Uh, these, besides She-Hulk, these were uh, of interest to me because they are from a show very dear to me. This is Scarecrow from Batman the Animated Series. I do own a few from the Animated Series. I have Batman, uh, Poison Ivy, Harley Quinn, and I can't remember if I have anything else. But now I have Scarecrow, another one in the box. And um, I do miss uh, Robin, I think, and the Man Bat that was a Comic Con, not the Comic Con, it was an exclusive, a SDCC, a con exclusive, I know it was, in 2018, 2019, I think, something like that. But this is one of the childhood anime series that I grew up with. Batman, Superman animated series, uh, Spider-Man animated series, uh, what was, what else was there? Uh, Iron Man, and there were some other Iron, uh, other animated series. My tongue swirls from the old animated series thing. So yeah, um, this depicts one of the villains in the series, Scarecrow. Loves to put up fear gas and all sorts of chemicals to induce pain and fear into people of Gotham and not only. Priya, uh, he's a doctor. He knows his stuff with chemicals. Hates Batman. Batman always tries to catch him. You know, the generic thing. So, yeah. Uh, it looks very cool. I'm gonna give it that. Oh, I actually miss a lot from the collection. Um, Bane, Batman Robot, Catwoman, Phantasm. I actually have not seen Phantasm ever. And I don't think I ever saw Catwoman. I saw Bane and uh, Batman Robot, but I never saw Phantasm or Catwoman. And this is from the second um, line of series. The first one is with Batman, Batgirl, I think, and other characters. Cool. Nice. Tell me what to do. 
Show me how to feel Under your control Everything is real So hit me So hit me Last but not least from this haul is Clayface from Batman the Anime series. Uh, it has, I think the box or something is pressing here. I really don't know why. He's a big fellow. He's pretty sturdy. He's pretty heavy. I'm gonna give it that. Uh, depicts Clayface in the animated series. He was a uh, actor uh, who was pretty all the time, and he was using creams, but he used some type of cream that uh, basically turned him into this. It had chemicals and all sorts of stuff in it, so it turned him into this. But the advantage is that he could shape shift and all those shenanigans. He's pretty fierce. I already showed you with whom he comes in the collection. The only thing that he has, he has a little bit here, but nothing too noticeable. Pretty okay, pretty decent, decent shape. So yeah. Uh, another villain from the Batman series, the anime series. This is a very, very awesome haul that I got. So, collection growing. To take my pride away from me You don't ever listen And you'll live with your complacency You don't scare me But you should feel me The sun is setting Don't trust to hear me You made a monster A mere imposter Go ahead and wander But don't trust the water so that was all i'm really really thankful for these especially for these two the animated series batman ones in very good condition i was after them for a long long time pretty difficult to get hopefully i could get others as well in the future uh i think now i have uh, these two and they are five in total in my collection so i really really hope i could get the rest of them thank you so so much once again for watching please do consider liking sharing and subscribing to this channel liking this video commenting please do comment throw a comment i want to see you guys in the comment section below uh talk to me say if you liked it if you didn't like it uh what else would you like to see Stuff like that. I will gladly answer and communicate with you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much once again. And until next time, stay safe out there. Bye-bye.